The overall goal of the following experiment is to use adult zebrafish in order to study kidney regeneration. This is achieved by injecting the nephrotoxin gentamicin into the peritoneal cavity of the fish to induce an acute injury response. Next, the fish are housed in individual tanks overnight for observation. During this period, cast formation occurs because injured nephron epithelia are sloughed off and collect in the lumen of tubules and ducts. Injured fish are identified the next day based on cast formation and can be used in further experiments to study kidney regeneration. We first had the idea for this method when we noticed that the injured fish excrete casts, which are a known indicator of injury in humans. The main advantage of this technique over the existing method for genomycin injection is that cast formation is an easy visual indicator of injury. After rearing 6 to 12 month old adult zebrafish and preparing gentamicin and tricane water according to the text protocol, make a fish scoop out of a plastic transfer pipette by cutting the bulb into a scoop shape and cutting two slots in the bottom to drain the water. Load 1 milliliter syringes with the prepared gentamicin solution and attach a 30 and a half gauge needle. Then remove any air bubbles and twist the needle on the syringe to make sure that the angled tip is facing away and the syringe markings are facing forward and readable. Prepare individual clear small half liter containers with lids for holding fish for observation overnight post injection and for observing the white epithelial casts shed by the fish. Fill each container with enough fish water for the fish to swim comfortably. <laughs> 